Okay, so custom instruction profiles. First, what is a custom instruction? Custom instruction are basically uh, these things that allow you to give ChatGPT a different character. You can basically tell ChatGPT how you want ChatGPT to respond to you, and based on your custom instruction, ChatGPT will respond to you. If you don't have um, access to GPT+, Plus, custom instruction are the closest thing you can get to custom GPTs. And they are free. They are available to everyone, so you don't have to pay for them. GPT plus to be able to create custom instruction. But with the default custom instruction that comes with um, chat GPT, the problem is that you can only create one custom instruction. And if you want to change your custom instruction, you have to um, delete the one that you already have and create a new custom instruction. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can create multiple custom instruction profiles and use them and switch between them anytime you want. So again, first thing you need to do, go to Google, search for superpower, chat GPT, and, um, sorry, superpower, chat GPT. Click on the first link and you're gonna go to this page. The, you're gonna see a button up here that says add to Google or add to Chrome. You click on it and it will add superpower chat gpt extension to your chat gpt once you install the extension you can go back to chat gpt this is like all the things that you can see here some of these features are added with this uh, superpower chat gpt including these folders that you can see i talk about them in another video but in this video i'm just going to talk to you about uh, the custom instruction so as you can see um with the extension, now we have this, this box right here on the new chat page. So there are three different ways to access your custom instruction. The first way is to click on your um, account name here and click on custom instruction. And that will open the custom instruction uh, window for you. The other way is using the short key, which is command shift or control shift plus I. Doing that will also open the custom instruction window. The third way, which is uh, this new way that we added here is right here. If you turn custom instruction on, this menu will become enabled and you can click on add new profile. So what you can see here is um, you just turned on custom instruction and you have multiple profile here. We have the personal profile, we have an assistant profile, and you can click on add new profile and it will open this window for you. Just remember, without the extension, without the chat superpower chat GPT extension, you don't see this. And you also don't see this menu up here when you open custom instruction. If you open ChatGPT without uh, the extension, the only thing you can see inside the custom instruction is this box and this box. But with the extension, you see all these extra things. So what you can do here, I'm gonna show you, like I have a personal uh, profile here, custom instruction profile. I can put whatever I want here. I can save it. I have another one I call assistant, has different type of information in there. I use it for different purposes. And if I want to create a new one, I can just click on add new profile and it will add, uh, allow me to insert a new one. I'm going to like maybe create a new one, call it um, test profile. And I'm going to just go here, copy some text here from my notes and go back here, put this in here. Custom instruction profile have a limit on the number of character. You can see down here, 1500. So I'm making sure that I only put less than 1500 character. And right here, I have the name. Uh, this field is full, this field is done. I can save this as a new custom instruction. And once I save uh, this custom instruction, it will close. Um, the window for me. I now have three custom instruction here. I can go ahead and select this one, the test profile, and I can use this. Remember, you can always uh, turn custom instruction on or off using this toggle switch here. What this switch does here is the same as this switch down here, enable for new chat. So if I turn off custom instruction, 
right here. It will be off and it won't be used for new chats. But if I want to use any of my custom instruction in a new chat, I just turn it on, go here, select the profile that I want, and I start using the chat. You can always switch between custom instruction and profile in the beginning of every new chat. You don't have to, like, if you, without the extension, you would have to go back to your custom instruction. You would have to go here. You would have to delete your custom instruction and replace it with something new, save it and use it. But with the extension, you can very easily just go here and create the profile you want. There is no limit on the number of profiles that you can create with the extension. And it makes it very easy to just switch between um, profile. And also you can always, like if you don't like the profile, you can just click on this trash icon and it will delete it, gone. There you go, you don't have that profile here anymore. Um, so yeah, that's uh, custom instruction profile. They are very powerful um, if used right, uh, and they can really change the way ChatGPT responds to you. Give it a try. Let me know what you think. Thank you.